Hey, I'm Ed from Bike Heads, and this is the Rucker Corius R Jacket. So we're right into a Rucker leather jacket here. It's been a few years since we had a waterproof leather jacket from Rucker, but now we've got one, let me go through some of the features with you. So, Rucker have given us this jacket. It's got a laminate product behind it. It's still a laminate like you'd expect from Rucker, so it's a material called Corium Plus. It's laminated to the leather in the background, so you're not gonna get any ingress into the jacket itself. So really important, it's a high quality membrane they've used here. It's been through loads of testing to make sure it's up to scratch to put the Rucker badge on. So, let's go through a few of the features. So starting from the top, as you'd expect, you've got your neck wrap. Zip off neck wrap, so it's removable in the summer. Obviously you need a neck wrap, the water runs down off the arms there. So it's perfect, works perfectly, just like the old ones did on the Rucker Merlin in the old days. Tried and tested. Running around there, you've got a lovely neoprene piece to keep your neck nice and comfortable. Coming down the arms, as you can see, it's full aniline cowhide on this product. Absolutely the highest quality, and it's all punch vented. The punch venting reduces the weight on leather and also increases the breathability. But why would you want a leather jacket that's waterproof when we've got so many high quality textile jackets on the market that you can use? The leather stretches, feels a little bit more comfortable. People like the look of leather. Obviously it's the safest material still used in a motorcycle garment. So some people like that leather feel, the look, the fact it stretches and the fact the abrasion resistance is so good on leather. And with this full aniline cowhide, with that punch venting, drops the weight but keeps the abrasion resistance up and that style. So running down the front of the product, Zip down the front, two pockets here. Obviously you've got a laminated membrane, so those are gonna be water resistant, but they're not gonna be waterproof because these zips aren't waterproof at all, so you're gonna get water not flowing straight through there. Big zip down the front, coming around to the side. Rucker logo is on a flat piece of leather here. Punch venting all down the arms, as you can see. The stretch panel on the elbow, so it's nice and comfortable. As you can see from the arm logo, you've got your D-throw armor built into shoulders, elbow, and back on this product. So you're still getting that D-throw protection you expect from a Rucker jacket all the way through the product. That's Rucker's own D3 armour, extremely comfortable, extremely flexible. Running down to the cuff here, simple zip and popper closure. You've got that gusset so you're not getting any water remain. Glove goes straight inside there, exceptionally well made around that part. If I lift the arm up, you've got your ventilation. Now quite often I talk about Gore-Tex ventilation, pro shells and allowing airflow. This one is exactly the same, it's a laminate product, you've got a direct air vent there. Little tip for anyone who's buying a jacket, put your hand behind the vent, try and blow through it. If you can't feel any air, it's not a vent. The air's going to flow straight through this product for you. If I spin it around further, you can see carrying on down the back, that punch venting still all the way down the back. So you're going to be getting loads and loads of breathability. A stretch panel on the bottom, just to aid a bit of comfort when you're leaning forward on the bike, it's going to give you a bit more stretch in the bottom when you've got the trousers attached. Coming around here, if I just open the front up, nice quality zipper on the front, storm flap, as I said, it's not a waterproof zip, so you need the storm flap to catch any water. On the inside, you've got this red strengthening zip on the inside and a pocket that's in front of that zip, so that's your easy access pocket right there, phone pocket inside that as well. So if I undo the second zip, you can see on the inside you've got this lovely thermal lining. That's going to be very, very warm in the winter, so remove that in the summer, you get a nice cool leather jacket, still waterproof in the UK. You've got wickable material on the inside here. When you sweat, you're going to hit that wickable material, it's going to spread out, it's going to push the moisture out of the jacket so it breathes a little bit better again. Another pocket on the inside of the lining, that side, red piping, nice finishing off. So we've finally got a nice Rucker leather jacket that we can sell. It's going to go out there, it's a beautiful product, beautifully made. It comes with a trouser, obviously, leather punch vented in the trouser as well. It's going to match the jacket zip on. One thing to note with Rucker, if you do want to buy this beautiful jacket, you want to wear a textile trouser with it, you can zip them together and vice versa. So if you bought the leather trouser, you can zip it to your current Rucker textile jacket. It's going to zip together perfectly and work perfectly well. So for any more information about the Corius R jacket, go to bikeheads.com, like and subscribe below, and I'll see you next time.